In this lecture, I will briefly describe each part of plant. Uh, while in coming lectures, we will discuss each part in detail. As we all know that uh, the, <coughs> the three basic parts of plant are root, stem and leaf. The root is a brown or white, non-green and underground part of plant. The general function of root includes storing of organic nutrients, encourage or support of plant and absorption of water and mineral. Mainly, there are three types of uh, root system, tap root system, fibrous root, and elevatious root system. Tap root system consists of one main vertical uh, root that gives rise to some large lateral uh, roots, while fibrous roots are comprised of numerous uh, thread-like roots. Uh, most of which are equal in size as shown in the second picture. The roots which originate from any part of plant body may be stem or leaves other than the radical is called the adventitious root system. Okay, as friends, uh, let's talk about the stem. In most plants, stem form the main axis of the plant body. Stem normally possesses nodes and internodes. Nodes are the uh, part of stem where leaves are attached, whereas uh, internodes are the region between the nodes. Uh, stems may be herbaceous or uh, woody type. Herbaceous stems are soft in nature and green in color, usually small in diameter, and secondary growth is absent. Possesses few heart hard tissue and mostly occur in annual plants for example wheat, rice, grasses etc. Whereas uh, woody stems are tough and hard in nature and are not green in color, larger in diameter and have a, a secondary growth and mostly found in perennials plant for example uh, mango and apple tree etc. The three principal functions of temp are uh, production and uh, support of leaves and flower in case of angiosperm and in case of germosperm uh, it support cones. Uh, the other function is uh, the conduction of substance through xylem and phloem and storage of food and water. Uh, stem uh, sometimes also act as a water reservoir in case of uh, succulent plants. For example, underground horizontal stem may form a tuber uh, that stores food. Uh, so, what is tuber? Tuber is a rounded storage organ uh, that can form from a stem or a root. Stem tuber, uh, if you look at a lower uh, left picture you can find uh, a small remnant or outgrowth of nodes and in internodes on the stem tuber example of stem tuber is brave leaves is the main photosynthetic part of the plant it absorbs light and helps in the exchange of gases through the stomata the leaf is usually flattened uh, the main part of a leaf include the leaf base, petiole and lamina, which we also call as a blade. Leaf grow at the node and bear a bud at the axil. The arrangement of veins and veinlets in a leaf are called a veneation. Monopod and dipod uh, in the arrangement of uh, vein is different. The vascular tissue of leaves uh, in most monocots have a parallel veins and in uh, dicots have a branching veins. Flowers are the reproductive part of plant. They attach uh, to a plant uh, of the stem um, called uh, the receptacle. The arrangement of flowers on the floral axis is called inferences. The flower consists of four different types of whorl or part calyx the outermost part of flower corolla composed of petals and rosium composed of stamens and gynecium composed of uh, carpal uh, so the next part is uh, stamens. A uh, stamen is actually consists of filament top by an anther uh, with the pollen sacs that produce uh, pollen. A carpal or pistil has a long style with a stigma on which pollen may land. At the base of style is an ovary containing one or more ovules. Okay, regarding seed, a seed is a small embryonic plant enclosed in a covering called a seed coat, usually with store food. Uh, the external part of seed is called seed coat and uh, seed coat is 
also called tester uh, students on seat uh, you can see helm which is actually a spur or mark uh, left on a uh, seat coat by the formal attachment to the ovary wall and uh, we also call it eye of bean the next is embryo embryo is a part of a sea sorber that contains the earliest form of plant root stem and leaf Okay, regarding cotyledon, uh, cotyledon is the first leaf that germinate. It is filled with the straw food and the young plant will use while it is growing. Pumule is the shoot tip with a pair of miniature leaves or uh, we call it leaves and stem developed from a pumule. Radical is the future roots and the part of seeds where the root develop. And uh, seeds serve several functions for the plants and that produce them. Key among these functions are the nourishment of the embryo, help in dispersal of seeds to a new location and also keep the seed dormant uh, during unfavorable conditions.